just picked up in, where we at? I don't know. <laughs> Where's the Somewhere lady. in New York. <laughs> oh, Albertsons. Yeah, Albertsons. Yeah, Albertsons. You want to make sure you secure your load. It's number one thing. You want to have your shipment slide left to right. You want to put your trash. Make sure it's tight. It should be aware. It's number one. <laughs> seven o'clock arrival um yeah so we're we're gonna drop off seven pieces lift gate was needed for this delivery so uh you know that's why you also need a lift gate because there's no telling when you'll have some loads that require a lift gate and if you don't have that lift gate then you know you're put in a situation where you're not getting as much loads as you can if you did have that lift gate, you know? So make sure you get a truck with a lift gate, have your pallet jack always on hand, you know? So you're not limited, you're not limited to these loads because some of these loads is paying good, they're paying good money, but if you don't got the equipment for the job, then you're out of luck. So, uh, yeah, so after that, then we have another load about, let's see, it's about 20, 25 miles deadhead. And it's in the same area, and it's actually headed to the way that we're coming back home. So we're gonna head home for the weekend. And um, we have a drop off on Monday to Baltimore, Baltimore, Maryland. So I don't expect us to, ha to have any problems finding a load out of there on Monday. So it should be fairly easy. So you know, when you get a load, you want to make sure that you, you're getting a load into an area where there's a lot of loads coming at them. So I believe we should have good, you know, good success finding a load out of out of Maryland. So you know, we'll keep it tuned. It's flex. I'll let you boy. to avoid that. So when you're coming out with a pallet, right? You don't want to go backwards. You want to go head first. So I'm going to take this U-turn. Take this U-turn like this. And I'm going to go head first. And the key about this is you want to come in at an angle. So you don't want to just put the pallet straight back. You want to come in at an angle and at a diagonal. So you wanna have your pallet jack horizontally on the pa on the pallet, on the uh, lift gate. So like this, I'm gonna come in more towards the left side, and then as I get halfway on it, I'm gonna turn this way. 
I'm gonna turn this right here, just like that. You wanna make sure you're clear off of the lip gate, all right? This is where people make the mistake. They do not drop the, the pallet jack. You wanna drop the pallet jack so the wheels don't turn as you're bringing the, pallet, the lift gate down. All right, so now it's secure. It can't go nowhere. Time to bring it down. to the bottom, now you can lift it. Thank you. 